went out and asked you what you wanted. You said you wanted a better playing environment. Now we have the applaud program running at schools and clubs. You said you wanted to be with your mates, to have fun and have a good season. So now you can. Register for rugby. Question, is college the best years of your life or is it just a random time and space? I actually got my school bag here from uh, back in Max. Back in my school days, SPW on it. My mum put it on just in case I lost it, you know. Pretty good. So, backpack, did you ever draw on it? Yeah, with Twink. What did you draw? <laughs> Probably can't see on here, so stupid things. Starter sign? Yeah, starter sign, all of it. Yourself? Oh, I had one of these bags. Definitely wore it across like this. Is that the yeah, style back that then? That was the style. It was the style back then. I think it still is. Yeah. That's when we used to play That's snakes that. on our phones, eh? Yeah. There you go. Yep. Our kids are on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram and school. Social media. Yeah. How good is table tennis? Do you think you could beat an All Black? You have played this game before, right? It's Makiri versus the All Blacks. Who would you bet on? All right, Sam, we're about to have a good game of table tennis here. All right, you're a fan of the game? Yeah, yeah, I've uh, actually played quite a bit. I'm uh, quite natural with my left hand, but I'll play you with my right, eh? All right, here's your back. Cool. Thanks. No See worries. you know we go. All right, serve it up. Lucky man of all of hey? Want me to serve? Yep. All right, here we go, first 11. How much do you want to lose by? All right. Ah. Oh, what is that? On the table, please. On the table. Oh no. Over there. Out. 11 now here. Seven. Eight. Come on. You don't want to be the only guy to lose by now. Here we go. Nine. Ten. Right. Now I'm starting playing serious. Ten. Ten. Go on. Eleven now. We can't finish like that. It's just way too sad. Let's go with this one, eh? I've got a better idea. Why don't you play with that one as well? See how it goes. Three no. Here we go. I can do that. No. Come on, I've got this. I've got this. No hole in the racket. Hiya. Ah, come on. Best point. <laughs> It's not a lot of fun with that, that bat, is it? I'm having a good time down this oh. end, eh? You don't like that backhand either, do you? Well done. It's one each, so we'll call it a draw. Call it a draw. Yeah. So you've got a pretty strict diet now. What did you eat back when you were at school? Well, back when I was at school, the struggle was pretty real. Um, so if we were lucky enough to have a bit of cash, definitely pies and chocolate milks. Cookie times was a favourite of mine. But uh, the problem was when we got our food or our pies, we'd go back to the boys and say, Oh, do you want some? Do you want a drink? And by the time we'd come back to you, by the time we'd come back to you, it'd probably be about that much. So you get one bite full, so you'd be licking your pie or 
spinning in your drink so the boys wouldn't drink it as well. So things you do yourself, you were an athlete back then. Well, my mum would probably pack me a really healthy lunch, probably some sandwiches or a roll. But walking to school, I did stop off at New World and get some hot chips or some sour cream, or maybe a Mrs. Mac pie. Yep, after school. Before training? So probably get maybe some McDonald's. Hey. Really bad. Um, but I didn't really know any better back then, you know? But a little bit more strict these days. Thank you. Oh, yeah. okay. Hi, I'm Will Blake, Victor Vito. Big Vic to all my adoring entourage. I'm Will Black Corey James. People call me handsome. I mean CJ. And welcome to the Rugby Clinic. The Rugby Clinic is an intense two-day camp for new rugby players keen to learn the basic skills. If we can't improve your game out of sight, then you're out of sight. Right, guys, today we're going to learn you. Learn you. To le learn? Teach. Teach. Teach you what you eat before you play. What you put in your engine helps you out on the field. Any ideas, people? Well, when I was a professional tennis player, I always loaded up on cards and always kept hydrated. It's <laughs> <laughs> probably why you never made it to the big time. Mmm, hold on, hold on. For me, it was steak and cheese pies, three raspberry buns, and a two litre Coke. Wouldn't that weigh you down? How many games do you play for the All Blacks? Uh, none. How many play Big Vic? 26. Most of them on the bench. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Each one of them counts a team game, and I'm getting paid. Well, while you're on the pine, getting paid, what do you eat? When I'm riding the pine, I like to eat pizza and fries. Fast food people. That's the key. Now, before we start, we have to eat these pizzas. We'll give you the edge. That one. You need some fattening up there this week. Yeah, you don't need any more pizzas. All right, let's get up. We're going to do some shuttles to warm up. Oh. Come on, you Come heard on him. Come on now. That's so. Get out there. They don't even eat the bloody pineapples. Yeah, somebody else paid for that. Let's go, let's go. Come on, come on, put some effort into oh. it. Why oh, are you looking tired? Yeah. Let's go. You look sick. What's wrong with you? Horrible technique. Come on now, come on. Put some effort into it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, this guy's looking sprightly right yeah. now. Oh, come on, come on. Sloppy, man. Let's go all the way to the end, all the way to the Run. end. You look sick, mate. Look like you've seen a ghost. Carry on. You're supposed to have energy. Off the line. Run. Come on, mate. What's going on with you? Oh, oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Jeez. Uh. Ooh, you see that? Bok choy. Bok choy? Who the hell is bok choy pizza? So what did you do at lunchtime? Um, what did I do at lunchtime besides eating my lunch or being in detention? I would have been playing touch, which turned into hold, which turned into tackle which turned into just bull rush running the straight so um, yeah, it was pretty pretty fun lunch times at Mount Abu Grandma. Yourself? Yeah eating the lunch, gossiping with friends, probably played a little bit of netball or just shooting hoops. Shooting Let's hoops? Shooting hoops, yep. There we go, shooting hoops. <laughs> well there was that game that you used to play around the ring, if you got it in you got to stand in the middle, did you oh, play that game? Around the world. Around the world that's it around the world. <laughs> this is SBW Skills, and today I'm gonna to show you how I move into the tackle. Sup team, sounds easy right? Just dominate the guy with a big hit. But here's the thing, if you don't get yourself in a good position, you're gonna come off second best, and that's not what we want. Here's a few tips on how to do it properly. So what you wanna do is you wanna slow your feet up going into contact. Slow your feet up and make sure you get your, your foot that's going to generate all the power as close to the guy as you can. So it's all, all about footwork, you're tackling with your feet. Slow your feet up, dip, and then come in. In real time, this is what it's going to look like. This is easy, no weights required. Just find a line on the floor and get busy. 
Engage your core and jump from side to side. You have to dance. Move your feet like a boxer in the ring. Never stay still. In and out, side to side. tickets for Saturday and we're going to tailgate and that is like eight degrees of Austin. Awesome. have a bit of an artificial pitch chucked in the middle of the train station, something new for us and yeah, probably something we won't experience again. Thanks guys, that's all we got for today. Hope you liked it. Because if you did, you can go check it out and lots of other stuff at randomrugby.co.nz. Right, I'm out. Later, Matt. Later. Daddy. Peace. <laughs>